one part for my Alright, so you're welcome to another episode of Trailer Reactions right here on GH Move Freak TV. Like always, my name is Sonia Sankuma, and like we've been doing on this show on this channel for some time now, I react to trailers that I see on the internet. Today, I'm reacting to another trailer from Nollywood. But before I go into it, if you already haven't subscribed to this channel, please do well to hit the subscription button and the notification bell as well. Uh, don't forget to like this video leave a comment in the comment section about the kind of stuff you want to see on this channel and also your thoughts on the trailer that i'm going to react to as well right and yeah let's just dive right into this one and see what it's all about okay because i tried to over a virgin and so so are you a virgin so logistics and supply Come on. But I really wanted to be inside criminal investigations or operations. Fine. Okay. What are you up to? I'm seven! Who raped? Who raped who? Okay. What were you doing? Were you sweeping? Get out. Oh, yeah, yeah, baby, I'm going to do it in this table. Okay, I'm going to do it in this table. Who is not on Who is not on that list? That is supposed to be there. Me, sir. We cannot sell out on our own. Even mm. if he is in the wrong, sir. He paints me to the ground. And he slapped me. God, do we need to do it? Would you like some juice and coolie coolie whiles you are it? Yes, sir. The sun is so hot. <laughs> hmm. Force Empire. Tribe Nation. Hmm. Interesting, 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 interesting. Well, uh, that was my first uh, look at this trailer. Um, I have quite a number of things to say about it, but um, let's just watch it again. This time I'll be reacting to it as a place, um, sharing my thoughts on it like I've always been doing. So let's just, um, let's just dive right into it this time around and see, yeah. So, so are you a virgin? Okay, so I first of all, I, this this would be like top of my head. This would be like the third um, Nollywood film that I've seen that is focusing on their armed forces. I think uh, a couple of years back when I started GH Movie Freak, um, I think I chanced on a trailer, something Wings, I think Eagle Wings or something that had to do with their Air Force. I never, I never saw. Um, I saw the trailer, I think I reached out to them, but I never got the chance to see the film. I haven't seen it anywhere else again. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but it looked really good. It had something to do with the Nigerian Air Force. And if I'm not mistaken, there's some other one that has Rams, you know, why it's, um, it's a 95 or 97 or something like that. But anyway, it's, it's nice seeing that they actually take time to make some of these films about their armed forces. I'm yet to see a Ghanaian film that uh, distinctively is about the, the any section of the Ghana armed forces. Well, you see action movies that feature the, the armed forces in it. Um, I'm not going to mention any titles, but yeah, you, you I yet to see a Ghanaian movie that really is focusing on the, the Ghana armed forces. I think the next thing I noticed that this this film has like this film has like the I don't want to say classic but it's got this um early 2000s yeah early 2000 mid 2000s Nollywood vibe to it it's not like the very very recent Nollywood films that are very very like almost cinematic it's almost very cinematic right um this one has that early 2000s mid 2000s vibe for me yeah and i i also appreciate the fact that there are a lot of like veterans or ace actors but someone said they don't like to be called veteran actors because they are still active so ace actors in in this one sheguna rinze rmd and uh, isa herself is it isa 
missions or operations. What are you up to? An extraordinary story. She kind of reminds me of um um I don't yeah I think she's past Mama Suja yeah <laughs> those who know me would 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 understand yeah Nigerians and Lexus. I also like that. I mean, they are very intentional about making sure they are there are local dialects in in all their films, which I really do appreciate. Um, particularly because most scenes feel very authentic when it's like in it's 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 in that local dialect. Yeah. Who is not on that list that is supposed to be there? Me, sir. We cannot sell out on our own, even if he is in the wrong, sir. Yeah. Paint me to the ground. She go. And he slapped me. You can't do anything to him. Would you like some juice and kuli kuli whilst you're at it? Yes, sir. The sun is so hot. <laughs> yeah. Okay. This is the this is the part that I didn't like about this trailer. Um, the end. I, I think the song at the end. I don't know why, but I I would rather it had been something original. I would rather it have been. I don't know. I, I, it just feels off for me, um, particularly because that's a song I've been seeing a lot on 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 Instagram in people's reels, or I've been seeing it in YouTube adverts, or I don't know. But it it just feels off for me for the film. But all the same, it does look like it. It does look like this. This is um. This this does look like it's going to be a fun film. Um, like I said already, I appreciate the fact that this is like the the second or third film from Nollywood that I'm seeing that is focusing on their armed forces. And for this one, the story seems to be talking about some sort of rot in 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 the army, or yeah, some sort of rot within the armed forces uh, that's got to do with rape. I think from the trailer, you get a better. A little bit of what the the story is about, um, particularly the scene where uh, one one of the officers says, "You don't sell out our own." So you kind of get the idea that okay, this has to do with some sort of rot going on in the service and someone within the service trying to expose expose that. So that ma that makes sense. That's quite clear. Um, yeah. Um, also, I've spoken about the quality of talent. I'm seeing Tony Omez over there right now. Um, Sheguna Rinze. Um, yeah, I think it's impressive that I mean this is not this is not like it's not like too many new faces. Well, too many young new faces, but these are like seasoned actors. So I can only imagine, or I can only expect a certain level of quality in acting that it's going to come in this film. Um, again, like I mentioned, this film particularly has this early two thousands, mid two thousands feel for me. Um, I'm guessing maybe because it doesn't have um, what we've seen in recent times where a lot of Nollywood films seem very intentionally cinematic in the choice of cinematography, in the choice of color grading. I think this looks very, quite basic. It looks almost like, um, it looks, I don't want to call it classic because classic would be taking it too, too far back in time. So yes, definitely early 2000s, mid 2000s vibe for me. Um, just not feeling that's, that song or that sound score at the end of the film, um, I feel like it's 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 a bit out of place. They should have rather put something original in there. I'm liking the you know the display of you know the armed forces with the you know I I would love to see something like that from the Ghana the Ghanaian film industry. Um, ceremonial attire, yeah this yeah that that particular scene with the cer ceremonial attire for um, her it, it looked a bit like. She looked. She, it looked like it, it's not her size. Be like that, yeah. <laughs> but maybe that's just me being too, um, me being too like, um, you know, paying too much attention to detail. But all the same, this looks like it's going to be an interesting film, uh, focusing on the armed forces and the rot in the service and blah 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 and it's going to sort of like expose and challenge some of the things that goes on in the army which i think is an interesting plot to be explored in a film um 
quality of acting we've, i've mentioned that uh, quality of talents i think that's going to do well for the film the force empire force empire as the title i'm not too sure about that it, it sounds force empire force empire if i just, if i saw this title somewhere what would be the first thing to come to me i think it's going to it's going to sound more like force empire sounds more like something star wars if you ask me yeah yeah it sounds something like star wars i don't know an episode of star wars but yeah all the same this this is a pretty much decent straight to the point trailer it's a little over one minute it's one minute 13 seconds uh gives you it teases you enough to make you want to see the film but uh, i mean that song at the end and yeah i'm um, compared to some of the trailers we've seen recently with the original music the cinematic look and feel of the, those films yeah i think this this is a little bit on the downside my overall rating my overall rating for this one i'm going to score this one three over five um, yeah three over five through three stars out of five stars for me on this trailer I, but i'm still going to look forward to see it and i'm i'm hoping that it's a good enough film it's a good enough story impresses me enough I understand it's being premiered on the 23rd of august yeah in nigeria i'm hoping that it lands on streaming a lot of these nigerian films end up on streaming so i'm definitely going to see it when it ends up on streaming anywhere yeah but three out of five stars for me let me know your thoughts on this trailer in the comments section below and yeah if you have any other comments or any other trailers that you want me to react to please do well to mention them in the comment section for me and i'll make sure to check them out like always my name is tonya sankoma this has been trailer reactions don't forget to like comment and share this video Hit the notification bell so that any updates or any uploads that we put on this channel you'll be the first to get it i'm out peace